my name is Natalie aka SM Glam Beauty and welcome to my channel if you're new don't forget to hit that subscribe button and if you're not new then welcome back I appreciate you being here again and so for today's video I'm doing an affordable makeup haul now I know that these are rough times and I shouldn't be spending money but I was bored in my house I was in my house bored if you have TikTok, then you know where that's from. But anyway, um, yeah, I was bored in my house and I decided to do, you know, a little bit of shopping. So when I shopped online, I decided to go to two websites, two affordable websites. One is e.l.f. and the other one is Wet n Wild. Half of these things are in the sales section. So if I were you, I would go to these websites and just pick up some things because majority of the things that I got are really 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 affordable like I got a makeup kit I got a blush kit and I got like a highlighter kit and some brushes and they were all affordable so if you guys are interested on what I got specifically then just keep on watching so if you know me then you know I love drugstore first off that's what I could afford like that's that's where I stay at sometimes I travel to you know Sephora and stuff like that but that's not all the time because a bitch is broke so I you know usually just stick to the drugstore side so the first thing I got from elf were these eyeshadow palettes and these are the mini bite size eyeshadow palettes and okay so I'm gonna swatch them so you guys can see i've heard really good things about these little palettes so i wanted to try them out for myself okay so that is a kai yu palette swatched i don't know how to pronounce that one it seems really really pigmented like wow i'm amazed don't worry i did sanitize these products before receiving them i mean you know like handling them okay so this is pumpkin spice right whoa this is super pigmented this is punk pumpkin pie whoa whoa guys look at this you do you guys see that Okay, Elf, y'all came to play. Y'all came to play. <sighs> or should I say, y'all didn't come to play because, wow, that is super pigmented. Okay, and the next one, oh wait, I have to open it. Oh my goodness, like the shimmers in these palettes. <laughs> I'm just, look at that. I swatched a uh, color here but it's it's too light to see but guys wow I'm super excited the best part of these palettes is that they're only three dollars only three dollars I'm about to go back to the elf website and get the rest of the palettes because so I also got the e.l.f. concealers. This one is the 16 hour camo concealer and this is a full coverage matte formula. Then I also got the hydrating camo concealer and this is a satin finish. I have the hydrating one on right now and so far so good. I have no complaints. This one is the hydrating one and this one is the matte one. Okay, so the next thing that I purchased from e.l.f. was their Primer Infused Shimmer Blush and their Primer Infused Bronzer. I got the blush in the shade Always Silly and the bronzer in the shade Forever Sunkissed. Um, I've never tried... I don't think... Oh yeah, actually I've tried their um, e.l.f. blushes, but the one that comes in the... Um, in the palette the blush palette so i'm super stoked to try these out i'm actually gonna make a uh, almost full face of elf products okay so the next thing that i got was a lip lacquer and this was not expensive at all it was probably like 
two dollars it's just like a gloss and it's in the shade natural natural looks like this is like a nice nude peach color you guys know me and my nudes <laughs> of course i had to get a nude um okay so i also got this elf active post-workout cool down mist wow this looks sophisticated i like the packaging so i was just thinking that i could just spritz this on whenever not necessarily for after i work out i'm just gonna use it as a regular setting spray but um i want to see the mist on this okay oh guys yo that smells so good it smells like a body mist wow that smells so good i'm not sure if it's totally good for your face but wow i'm impressed i kind of want to put it on i'm gonna put it on wow okay so it smells good it just smells strong when you put a lot so be careful if you're sensitive to strong smells then you're not gonna like this too much i really like the spray on this it's kind of aggressive but it's still fine okay elf you got it <laughs> so last but not least i got this little bundle this was actually on sale, so you guys probably could get it. I think I got this for $15, and it brings a highlighter, um, a liquid lipstick, a lip liner, and some brushes. So let's open this up. This, oh my god. And it brings a little... This is so cute. There's a dome stipple brush dome stippled brush there's a highlighting brush there's a powder brush yeah powder brush there's a flat eyeshadow brush and there's a crease brush oh my god these are so freaking cute i definitely don't need more brushes but <laughs> come on guys like it's me it's me okay i have like a million brushes <laughs> I don't like washing my brushes so I rather buy than wash don't do as I do do as I say you don't need more brushes so this is the lip liner Ooh, and it's called oh it's not called anything it doesn't have a name okay so this is the lip gloss I believe Ooh, I like the, the applicator in this. Ooh, I like the color in this. So this is the lip liner and the lip gloss. Cute colors, cute. <laughs> I'm so excited, guys. Makeup gets me excited. Okay, so let's try the highlighter. So this is the highlighter. I don't know if you guys can see so i'm not such a huge fan of um loose highlighters but this one's nice i'm not even gonna lie i don't need any more highlighter but i kind of want to just put some on so i'm gonna just i'm also using the highlighting brush from this kit wow oh oh my goodness I look like a glazed donut, guys. I look like a glazed donut. So, guys, that is what I got from e.l.f. I also did an order on Wet n Wild. And can I just say, I love Wet n Wild. Both Wet n Wild and e.l.f. are my favorite, favorite, favorite drugstore brands. So, I got the Photo Focus Foundation Dewy version. And that's what I have on my face now. Now, I usually wouldn't pick this up because I am oily or at least I have an oily T-zone. So, 
this doesn't really last on my face but so far so good i did my makeup like around four o'clock and it is it's 9 57 right now so i only had to touch up once my skin looks kind of healthy it looks healthy so that's good <laughs> but i also picked up the regular the original photo focus foundation the matte one and um i picked them both up in the same shade golden beige so yeah i didn't order this online this is the bretman rock and wet n wild palette they did a collaboration together and came up with this palette and a few other things and the palette looks like this i i still haven't opened it yet as you can see i can't wait to play around with this um i'm gonna swatch some colors all right not bad not bad these are some of them swatched these are the shimmery shades i'm gonna swatch some mattes swatch i'm about to swatch <laughs> Does anyone else think swatch is a weird word? Swatch. I'm going to swatch. Swatch. Oh my gosh, guys. Somebody get me out the house. Please. Can quarantine be over? That's nice, too. And these are some of the mats. The mats are, you know, they swatch a little. But you never really know up until you, like, Play with it on your eyes it's two different things so i got a couple of things from this collection i got the highlighter which is called liger and i'm gonna swatch these as well oh okay fancy look they open it opens like this like a butterfly okay so and it has his initials on it so cute all right so i swatched both like bo on both sides one is more like a glittery kind of highlight and the other one is more like a shimmery highlight i don't know if you can tell by my swatches but i think i'll use the goldish one more than the pinkier one but to be honest i'm not such a huge fan of highlights like this i also picked up the bretman rock and wet n wild mascara and can i just say i like this mascara i'm using it on my eyes now and they really like give my lashes volume and length i also picked up a lip gloss it's called ferocity ferocity um and i haven't opened it yet and i have so i've swatched so many things like my hand is like full of glitter and shimmer and all that stuff nice this is how it looks it has like this gold gold shimmers on it you see it it has like this gold shimmer it's like clear with gold shimmer i'm gonna put some on because why not i'm totally a gloss girl so y'all know i have to pick up this gloss come on oh shit oh i did a it's too bad I didn't, I didn't open it properly. But yeah. The last thing that I got from Wet n Wild and Bretman Rocks collection is this highlighting brush. I was going to get another brush. But guys, I don't need more brushes. But I got more brushes. Crazy. I really like the packaging in this whole collection. I really like the jungle vibes. Love that. I also got this... Um, retractable eyebrow pencil from wet n wild it's more like a repurchase i should have got two i just got one but i was running low so i had to get this um okay and i also got this and y'all know what this is this is pac-man so this is wet n wild and pac-man's collaboration and guys this was on sale for like ten dollars maybe and once i saw it was on sale and it was pac-man i had to get it come on who did not play pac-man when they were younger maybe kids from this generation but guys i had to get this this little bundle came with a brush a bronzer and blush a blush powder so guys yo 
This is so cute. So I'm going to take out the brush first because I love Wet n Wild brushes, guys. I love their brushes. This is good for like powder. What's this? Guys. I love brushes like this. This is so cute. Okay. So I got that brush. I got this palette. The palette is called High Score. And I'm assuming this is, this says it's a limited edition collection. So I'm glad I got this. And it was affordable, guys. So how do you open this? Oh, wow. That was a mission to open, guys. Um, ooh, okay, so I'm not really such a fan of shimmery blushes, and this has three out of four. Um, but, you know, I'll live, I'll live. Sometimes, if you dip your brush in and tap off the excess, you, you don't get so much shimmer. So hopefully, that's the case with this blush palette. So the bronzer's name doesn't have a name. Doesn't have one, okay. Okay, so the heck? Oh, okay, so this is how the bronzer looks. It's like the little balls. I was, I'm not a fan of, of, of products like this that have the little balls. I just, nah, whatever. But I'll try it. Guys, I also had to get this, and this is one of my favorite favorite lip glosses from wet and wild it's the shade send nudes guys you know this is like my go-to if it's not the essence matte lipstick then i'm most likely wearing this and this is bomb bomb.com i love this i know a lot of the like lip glosses that i bought are like glosses and nudes but yeah that's that's all that's all I'm about guys I, I really like nudes I feel like it matches with everything last but not least I got this this is the wet and wild 17 piece brush roll and I definitely did not need this in my life but the price guys the price got to me it was only $15 guys it was only $15 for 17 brushes plus this Guys, I'm a shopaholic. I need to stop. This one, this is a good deal. And I already have some of these brushes. This is definitely perfect for someone who's starting off with makeup. First off, they're good brushes. They're very affordable and they're user friendly. This is also travel friendly. I might just keep these here. And whenever I do travel, I will just pick up this whole kit and just... And I don't have to like go through all my other brushes. I could just use these. Ooh, look at me coming up with ideas. So yeah, guys, that completes this video. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye. I'm almost done. 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 <laughs>